Hi, I'm Jenna Espelito from the Philippines. Sono Alessio, studio economia. Ciao, sono Roberta. Hola, soy Juan Pablo, de México. Sono Anna. Oi, sono Valkyrie. Ciao a tutti, io sono Giulia. Mi nome è Melissa, sono colombiana. Sono interessata a partecipare all'economia un Francesco perché credo che sia una sfida per noi giovani, per metterci in gioco e perché l'economia è una cosa bella. Economia of Francesco per me è un segno di hope perché ci dà l'opportunità to us youth to do something about our future and it makes us the protagonist. Quiero ir al evento de Economía de Francisco eh, porque considero que se requiere un cambio de paradigma en la economía. Y convido a todos vocês para participar en el evento de Economía de Francesco que será en 2020 en Assis. Next year will be an amazing, amazing event. To create a new world economy that is fair, prosperous, and environmentally sustainable. And the uh, work that will be underway in Assisi will be world changing and will be so exciting for all of the world and so productive for the coming generations. Young people are saying we need change. Young people are striking for climate safety. Young people are saying our world cannot continue to be broken as it is now. We want peace, we want cooperation, we want environmental sustainability, we want justice. Young people all over the world are saying that the economy of Francesco is going to show through deliberation and through brainstorming how this can be accomplished. I will come for the economy of Francesco because we need a new economy, a new vision, and the teachings of Pope Francis uh, in Laudato Si and in other teachings help to give us the pathway to a better world and a happier world and a sustainable world and an ethical world. So it's a thrill to be part of the change underway that is going to produce happiness throughout the world. This is something, a global uh, example, inspiring people around the world. This is life of the poor people can be changed. And what I'm been telling people that poverty is not created by the poor people. Poverty is created by the system that we have built. So we have to address the system. The system is cranking out poverty every day. So unless we stop that, poverty cannot be stopped. So we have to go back and look at where, where the poverty is starting. It's all the wealth of the world is concentrated in 1% uh, of the people, 99% of the wealth going into the hands of 1% of the people. This is totally unacceptable. So we need to create a circular economy so that we don't continuously destroy the wealth of the world. Uh, we recreate them, we redesign them, uh, we protect the environment. Uh, we are in a disaster path right now. So we want to stop that. This is what uh, we'll be discussing in March uh, 2020, uh, how to redesign the system, how the young people play their role. Young people are very powerful people. They have enormous capacity, enormous creative capacity, enormous technology in their hand. If they set their mind, they can change the world very quickly. So that's what Pope Francis is trying to do, bring the young people together, give them the challenge. This is the world which is sinking. This is the world which is uh, uh, in a disaster path. How to redesign it, reprocess it, so that we can move into the direction where we can build a beautiful world uh, for everybody, not just few fortunate people. Uh, we want to make sure that everybody has equal chance in this economy. Everybody can contribute to the economy and the welfare of the people. So this will be the discussion in the March 2020 campaign.